Did you find Kate Howard? We sent patrol officers to check her office. It looks like she cleared out. Did you check Kate's house? No sign of her. What about the Metro card? Did somebody look there? A patrol officer spoke with the hotel staff. Miss Howard was seen in the lobby. She had some altercation with another woman, Carly Jacks. Then Miss Howard left the lobby. Well, well, can you put out an APB? I, I, I know there's not a lot to go on, but if Kate really is the one who attacked her, she's the attacker. Then... We know that for a fact. And you're right, she's extremely dangerous. We need to speak with Dr. Keenan. Wait, if Dr. Keenan's been moved to the ICU. He's in no condition to talk to anyone. He dies. Miss Howard is looking at murder He's not charges. Die. He can't. Jason, where did you find Kate? It's complicated. We need to see Dr. Keenan right away. Dr. Keenan's been admitted to the ICU. Why? What's wrong with him? He was attacked last night in his office. Oh my God. Is he all right? No, he has a severe brain injury. Do they know who did it? It was you, Kate. You attacked him. Connie? Connie did that? Oh, she said that it'd be a while before Dr. Keenan felt up to treating patients. That's what she meant. Oh, oh, God, she attacked him. Oh, she was proud of it. Dr. Keenan said, Connie, was the one who attacked him, and Olivia said, Connie is what they used to call you before you changed Because I left Connie oh. behind. I never wanted to see her again, but she had other plans. You're talking as if she's another person. She's sick. She needs a doctor. or a good psychiatrist on call? Yeah, yeah, okay. Kate Howard. Yes? You need to come with us. Why? We need Miss Howard to answer some questions. You have to wait. Miss Howard is ill. I just brought her in for treatment. I'm going to get her some help. Okay. Psychiatrist will be over to see you in a few minutes. You okay? I just can't believe this is happening. I'm waiting for a doctor from the psych ward. Just, just sit down. I'm sorry. Until the doctor signs off on you, we're gonna have to cut Can you just back off right, for a Jason, second? It's okay. I want to cooperate. Just... How did you happen to be the one to find her? It's, uh, it's complicated. It's complicated? Yeah, yeah, you mentioned that. She's sick. She doesn't even know what's happening when Connie takes over. Okay, it doesn't surprise me that you would have compassion towards her, but I don't understand. Why are you not taking care of your own situation? I'm fine. No, oh, Jason, I know that you're upset that Sam's getting help from that cop with Bane. Have Sam you guys moved out. Jason, I'm sorry. Elizabeth. Elizabeth. I'm losing my shot. We need a doctor. Just a grace. Yeah, I'll get a call. What, what happened? Look, Ronnie Domestico kidnapped Lulu and Sam. Where, where's Sam? At the Haunted Star. No, Jason, Jason, there's already another officer on the scene. Hey guys, I'm sorry. Dr. Rushi will be in in a few minutes. You got hung up with a patient. That's okay. I'm okay. Yeah, no, sure. Problem is making sure I stay calm. Well, how's it working out for you? Well, he's not pacing around anymore, so I think that's better. <laughs> Let me peek at this. Oh, I can't believe a cop did this to you. Yeah, Ronnie lost it. You think? Beating up those girls takes you and Sam hostage? What happened to Sam? Oh, she was handcuffed to a railing and. She couldn't get away. Look, if Lulu hadn't been shot, we would have stayed there with her, but uh, McBain is taking care of her. McBain? Uh, yeah, John McBain, he's a, he's a cop from Pennsylvania. He was with us at the Hunted Star. He's not going to let anything happen to Sam. 